what's up guys mark from wandering souls back with a new video um this time a vinyl update um a pretty big one i have to say as well i went to a record fair this uh, sunday and um yeah let's start to pick up some things there um so yeah all the kind of metal genres so expect everything um from heavy metal to black metal to death metal um, I have a lot of different kind of stuff um, yeah it's pretty cloudy there um, a lot of people a lot of vendors um, a lot of a lot of stuff there as soon as I walk if I dro drove into the parking lot I knew it was gonna be really really uh, crowded, um, a lot of cars and when I came to the door to enter the hall um, there where, where it held um, I was already in a line and the fair was already busy for an hour so uh, I thought man it must be busy there uh, crowded um, so uh, yeah Anyways, just went in, uh, paid at the door and um, scored me some records. Um, the first thing I came across was an album from Saxon and I came across this for very cheap. I thought, why not? I don't have this one yet. A strong arm of the law. Back, hope you guys can see it a bit. And this one is a gatefold, and that's pretty rare for the, such an old pressing because this is a 1980 pressing done by a Carrera Records from France. Um, label, the vinyl is just black vinyl. But yeah, awesome bands. I really love this album, and uh, I didn't have it on vinyl yet, so I thought, let's buy this. Pretty cool release. Um, Sex and Strong Arm of the Law. Let's create a bit light here because there's not much light in here. And then I scored um, three records on my one of my favorite sellers. Um, so I went to the guy and gave him the fee records to pay and um, he gave me a discount for 5 euros so <laughs> thank you very much, really appreciate it. Um, first one is Hard Rock Heavy Metal from Denmark, this is Pretty Mates with the Future World and this is their 1987 album, um, Hard Rock Heavy Metal, really great stuff. And this is a CBS pressing as you guys probably see. And this one just comes on plain black vinyl. Um, I actually don't have to show it because it's kind of pointless. But um, I could do it do it anyways so you get an idea. Um, yeah. Black final CBS logo. I was really glad to find some old material from Pretty Mates. Uh, it's not in every store available. Um, most of the time, you see the the new releases from this band. So I'm really stoked to get some releases by this band. I also scored the album prior to that, um, Red Hot and Heavy, on vinyl. Pretty Mates. And it's all pretty flimsy covers because it's a European pressings. Um, and this is on the Epic label. But yeah, I'm really stoked to find some pretty mates. Um, I'm I'm getting really into this band at the moment. Uh, I really love the latest album, which was an amazing album. I thought I have to have some more earlier. 
and I stumbled it on um, it today so I'm really glad that I went pretty much red hot and heavy and also scored an album from Body Farm on that cellar the latest one Dreadlord and 2019 release and this is some old school death metal from the Netherlands released by No Dust Records let's get the stuff out here it comes with the booklet here also comes with a big poster stuff I really love this kind of metal um, old school death metal is awesome in my opinion so yeah I'm really glad to find this um, and it was not expensive at all so I thought why not could also pick it up at uh, no dust records where I stand there as well but I uh, chose for this one heavy black vinyl you guys can see it a bit because the labels are a bit dark. And this is what definitely 180 gram. It feels like more, but So that's that, um, that were the first couple of albums. Then I scored an oldie from uh, Amort Saints, which is a pretty cool band from the US. Definitely one of my favorite albums from this band, this is March of the Saint. I really wanted to have this and I'm glad I found it for a really decent price here. This is all pressing as well. Uh, 1984 and go as on the crystallizes label and it's really I'm really stoked to find such a good copies of the albums um, I wouldn't have expected all this old stuff um, but yeah I'm really glad that I could find all this stuff and um, great great releases no come on but yeah classic album first album from this band and I'm really glad to have it definitely looking forward to give this a spin and I really enjoy the artwork as well with the Knights great band and the last two are um, more extreme metal um, I found this at the no dust stand I think uh, this is Tadenkappe with Tussenhun and the Zon Black Metal from the Netherlands um, released by Hammerhard Records in the lyric sheet um, Yeah, really stoked to give this a spin as well I have heard this in the past but it's been a long time ago a couple of years I think um, at the black final but yeah if you're not familiar with this band um, yeah, great black metal um, sings in Dutch as well and she some um, German and some English titles, so um, yeah. 
But yeah, really great stuff. Tarn Kappen. Tussen hun en de zon. This is the first album. I think this was from 2013 or something. And I'm glad to have this now. And the last one was a really jam. Um, um, almost at the end. Um, almost time to go away from the fair. Um, didn't have super much money mirror again with me. Um, yeah, after six records, you know. Um, but yeah, then I found this one in the last haul. Um, I wasn't really expecting anything in that haul, but I found this one for only 12 euros, and I thought I have to have this. Um, yeah, there's a couple of al other albums as well by this band, but I was really surprised that he had this one such for a such cheap price. Um, I couldn't believe it. Um, Dark Throne, Soul Side Journey, um, classic first album from this black metal band. Although this is a death metal album, um, and you know how I think about this album. If you have seen my CD version uh, in an update uh, some while ago in my, one of my older videos. And this comes from Heavy Black Final. This is actually a 2012 reissue, but um, I don't really care. It's a gem for me, and I really wanted to have this on vinyl. And I had really suspected it was there. Um, if I had more money to spend, then I was uh, obviously uh, bought more vinyl records from this band at that stand. Because all the albums he had were 12 euros, so I thought, too bad I'm such a poor guy. <laughs> Anyways, um, great stuff, great album, Dark, Dark Throne, Soul Side Journey, fantastic album. Yeah, that's it guys, that's what I bought at the record fair, seven records. Um, Hopefully you discovered something new. I will put links in the description to the band so you can listen to them. Um, and let me know what you think of it. What you think of the hall and the records itself and etc etc. Just let me know in the comment section down below. Um, last thing before we go. We're listening to Ultra Tomb with Necro Vortex. Fantastic Quebec death metal. Um, old school stuff. Heavy crushing. Um, death metal um, yeah that's it guys uh, thank you for watching tuning in and um, hope to see you guys back soon with another video cheers